Tyler here with GP Knives, and today we've got the Kaiser Knives Guru. This is a full titanium frame lock flipper. It's got a sheep's foot blade with a satin finish and a high height saber grind made of highly wear resistant CPM S35VN. It's got a nice robust blade stock thanks to that saber grind and is going to excel at hard use cutting tasks. The high height saber grind gives it plenty of slicing capability. It's got a nice sweeping belly here, almost on the level of a worn cliff, but not quite so straight. And it does still have plenty of point here for piercing tasks while retaining some of the additional safety of a sheep's foot style blade. The handle scales are made from bead blast titanium with a nice matte gray finish. This one's got milled holes that give it a nice aesthetic appeal as well as helping to lighten the overall weight and give a little more grip to the surface area. Got an open back construction on these with a single barrel spacer and a 3D machined titanium pocket clip set up for right hand tip up only carry. And inside the pivot we've got a bearing system. So this is going to deploy very smoothly and rapidly. You can see here very quick to deploy, nice moderate detent on there. Got an index finger choil here for choking up on the blade for finer cutting tasks. And then plenty of handle here for a full four finger grip. And as I said before, these holes do add a little bit extra in terms of grip surface. Got a hardened steel lock face insert that doubles as over travel protection which you can see here, so it keeps you from overextending that titanium lock bar. Very smooth operation on the lock and easy one-handed access. We've got a lanyard hole back here for those who choose to carry their knife with a lanyard. And this knife does come in several variations. So we've got both flipper and thumb stud opening. Let's see here, this is the other flipper with just a flat bead blasted titanium handle scale. So those are the two flippers. And then we've also got thumb stud opened with the same handle scales, both a bead blast and a milled hole. And these all operate on bearings, so the operation is very smooth. All the specs are gonna be identical minus the opening. So if you like a more traditional non-flipper style blade, you can get either handle option in either configuration. And here's a quick shot of all four of them together. And here you can see the Guru in my pocket. The titanium pocket clip isn't a deep carry, but it does put the knife fairly deep in the pocket with only a small portion of the titanium handle protruding, giving you access to that lanyard hole. The retention on the titanium pocket clip is very secure but also very smooth, allowing easy access to the knife as well as easily putting the knife back in the pocket with one hand. And the slim and contoured profile of the handle on the Guru allows easy access to other items in the pocket while carrying. And for a quick size comparison, we have it here with the Spyderco Paramilitary 2. So you can see that the Guru is a little bit smaller than the Para 2. Uh, a little bit less handle and a little bit less blade. Very similar in blade stock thickness, with the Guru being just a little bit thinner at the base of the blade. And as you can see here, it's got a much more robust tip thanks to that sheep foot design and full saber grind. So, you're gonna have fairly similar performance between the S30 and the S35. And then, of course, the weight on the Guru is gonna be a little bit higher thanks to those beefy titanium handle scales, but you do have the added benefit of a nice contoured handle scale there. So this is going to be a little more comfortable in the hand with those rounded scales. If you like what you've seen today and you'd like to see more, check out the rest of the videos on our YouTube channel, like the video below, and subscribe to our YouTube channel feed for updates on all new and upcoming videos. Again, that's the Kaiser Guru. Designed by custom knife maker Matt Degnan. Check it out now at gpknives.com. Thanks for watching and stay sharp.